Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill rack daily challenge using Python programming language. We will understand our question. In a supermarket, there are x unique products represented by a number are listed in the board. A boy wants to purchase y unique products from the supermarket that is the boy wants to purchase some products that are available in x unique products represented by a number that is listed in the board so the program must print the products that are available to the boy in the order of shown in the board the idea is very simple we have to find the common products in y and x then we have to print them in the order of the products available in the market so we have also given a note that at least one product is always available for the boy then our input format is the x y integer then the x unique products listed in the board then the y unique products which the boy wants to buy now consider our first test case here the x is 7 and the products wanted by the boy is 3 so the 7 products that are available are 3 4 6 2 7 1 9 and the wanted products are 2 1 6 now we are going to iterate the products that are available in the market and check for the product that is wanted by the boy so first we will check for 3 then 4 and so on so for 3 it is not wanted by the boy then 4 is also not wanted by the boy then 6 is wanted by the boy so in our output we will have 6 first then 2 is also wanted by the boy so 2 then 7 is not wanted by the boy and 1 yeah it is wanted by the boy and 9 is not wanted by the boy so 6 to 1 will be our output now consider our second test case that the x and y is 5 and 5 that is the number of products available in the market and the number of products that the boy wants is same now we'll iterate over the number of products available in the market that is 5 4 3 7 10 now 5 is not wanted by the boy then 4 is also not wanted by the boy 3 is wanted by the boy so we will print 3 first then 7 is wanted by the boy so we'll print 7 then 10 is also wanted by the boy so 3 7 10 will be our output let us implement our program first we will get the number of products available in the market and the number of products wanted by the boy is x and y then we will get the products that is available in the market then we will get the product that the boy wants so we have got all our inputs now we will iterate for product in products that is the product that is wanted by the boy that should be in the order of occurrence of the products so for product in products then we will check if the product wanted by the boy is available in the products the boy's product so if the product is wanted by the boy then we are going to print the product and use the end argument the program is simple right so we will check for our first test case here we have got our output as 6 to 1 as 6 is wanted by the boy then 2 is wanted by the boy then 1 is also wanted by the boy now we'll execute our second test case here 3 7 10 is our output 3 is wanted by the boy 7 is wanted by the boy and 10 is also wanted by the boy hope you guys understand thanks for watching see you in next video